Namaskar, I am Pali Nithika, 4th year MBBS student at Negrim Shillong. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be talking about Medical Colleges of Northeast India. And at the end, I'll tell you about top four medical colleges of this region. In my need, I'm only talking about government medical colleges. And I'll be going statewide. So let's begin. First of all, I'll begin with my own state, that is Arunachal Pradesh. Arunachal Pradesh has only one medical college, that is Trims. Coming to Meghalaya, Meghalaya also has only one medical college that is Negrims. Coming to Manipur, Manipur has two medical colleges that is Rims and Jainims. Coming to Tripura, Tripura has one medical college. I'm only talking about government medical college. Now coming to Assam, Assam has eight medical colleges like AMCH, GMCH, Silchar Medical College, Tejpur Medical College. And Sikkim and Nagaland they still do not have their own government medical colleges so these are the government medical colleges of this region now coming to top four medical colleges of this region but before i begin this video i'll give you some kind of disclaimer that this list is totally based on my opinion my observation i'll tell you my parameters first one is feasibility affordability how is the fee structure and the second one is environment how are the senior how are the teachers how is the environment okay you might have different parameters like how are a student doing after passing out i mean are they getting pg seats or not those things okay but for that i always tell you if you really want to do something in life you can do it it doesn't matter from where you are doing your mbbs i always tell you if you are doing your mbbs from an mci recognized medical college your job is done that's all you need for example if you are doing MBBS from AIMS New Delhi, but still if you are not studying You won't get PG as simple as that. It is you who should make your college proud Suppose if you are doing MBBS from Peri Peri be the topper of NIT PG make your college proud There is no doubt about your intelligence if you are cracking NIT if you are coming to medical college You are smart enough you are intelligent enough So don't think about those studies and all if you really want to study you will study but if you don't want to study wherever you are kept you won't be studying as simple as that now coming back to the list the rank one i would give is rims manifu because fees are also feasible admission fee is around 70 to 20 000 and mess fee is around 2000 to 2500 per month i don't know the exact figure because during my time it was different but it is different now that's why i'm telling you a round figure okay and academic is also good seniors are also good you have social life also and moreover this is not a state medical college and the second rank i would give is negrim shillong reasons are first the environment environment is the best in the country that i can tell you for sure and this is a central institute seniors are really good teachers are good academic is good but fees are not that feasible admission fee is forty-seven thousand. And the mass fee is 3720 per month and it is not like before earlier it was better but i hope in future it will continue to grow and the third rank i would give is aims guhati you may think this college doesn't even have a structure why you're giving this third rank i'm giving this third rank because this is a central institute this is aims they have their own standard in future i'm very sure aims guhati will surpass all the state medical colleges of the northeast so if you want to join AIMS, you can join. And the fourth rank I would give is GMCH, that is Guwahati Medical College and Hospital. Because academics are good, environment is fair. Seniors, I won't comment on that. I have friends there, but I won't comment on that. Okay, so those were the top four medical colleges. You might have different opinion. And if you have any query, you can put that down in the comment section. Thank you for watching. Jai Hind.